Blue Sky Plan now contains the functionality to automatically, completely automatically, add buttons to the Orthodontics Digital Tooth Setup. And I'll show you how to do that in this video. So we're at the stage where I've already snapped the teeth to the curve, confirmed the tooth placement, and now I'm at the step where I could choose what to do next. So I have the checkbox to add buttons. I also have my different options here about how I want to continue after I add buttons. Do I just want to proceed to export the models? Do I want to design printable aligners? Or do I want to design an aligner trim curve for automatic mill trimming of the aligners? So I'm going to make the selection to add buttons and then to proceed to export models only. And of course we have full tutorials on demonstrating the process flow in order to go through the orthodontics digital aligner tooth setup. I'm not going to demonstrate the whole process now. I'm going to focus right now on the functionality to automatically add the buttons. So when I have add buttons checked in the checkbox and I click continue to add buttons, what I see happening automatically is the software takes us to the next step and we can see that the buttons have been placed automatically based on the movement of the teeth. So the software is determining where the buttons should be placed based on the tooth movement steps and has added and add the buttons. If I want to go ahead and remove particular buttons, all I need to do is to make sure the correct jaw is selected, right click on a button, and here I can move or rotate or enlarge. I have all the functionality to modify any particular button. I also have the measurements of the button to the edge of the tooth in any of the direction. If I want to modify the button, I can go ahead and modify that very easily using the widget. If I want to simply remove a button, then I can just right click on the button and click remove. And of course we have undo and redo in the top corner. So it's really as simple as that. You could confirm the button placement. If you would like to manually add a button, simply right click on a tooth, choose add button, and you'll access our button library. We have several different options and sizes from the drop down list. Simply select the set that you like to place, select the relevant button and the general size. Of course, you'll be able to resize once it's placed. Click the add button and the button is added. You could then mouse over the widget comes up and use any of the widgets functionalities in order to resize, rotate, move the button that was just placed or any other button. Once you're happy with the button placement and you've confirmed that, simply click continue and the software will take you to the next step based on your selection that we saw previously with the radio buttons.